You need to go to tutoring? Tutoring's a band-aid, people. Most of the 20 or so students huddled up close to the front of a San Diego City college classroom are just about to start their college careers. Unlike the others, Bon Jovi Brown has already been at City College for a semester. But halfway through this three-day program called the STEM Success Academy, the 25-year-old has a new perspective on his approach to school up to this point. It gives me, um, you know, steps in order to prepare myself because I was one of the students walking into class blind with no preparation, you know, no prior plan, just expecting the teacher to just tell me what I need to know and follow the book. Show of hands, how many of you approached it like I just, sh just uh, reviewed it here? The academy is run by Rafael Alvarez, director of the MESA program at City College. MESA supports minority or disadvantaged students who are studying math, science, and engineering. But Alvarez says one of the reasons only about 60 percent of City College students working toward a degree actually get one is that there are too many like Brown who don't know that there's help available from day one. There's an expectation of them that they know how to approach the learning when they start. Not, I mean, not a, a week, two weeks after the semester starts. Sometimes they don't even find us until midway through the semester. And at that point, we're trying to do a lot of uh, damage control. That's why Alvarez got the Summer Academy started, to introduce students to what he calls the Mesa learning culture before they walk into their first college class. When you have a group of problems, you don't just jump, you, you're, you're assigned problems 3, 6, 9, 12. You don't just jump into the problems. You want to look at the big picture. You want to get invited to the academy, students already had to be a step ahead of many of their new classmates who need remedial math and English classes. But even for 17-year-old Marissa Maldonado, who took AP classes as a high school senior, it was a revelation to hear about strategies like spending no more than 20 minutes stuck on a test problem. I was doing it in calculus. I struggled so much because I thought that I knew what I was doing, but like you said, there's variations between the problems. And so I'd stick and I'd try like everything and I didn't know what to do. And I would stick to it. I'm like, I got this, I got this. Did I take the 20 minutes and stop? No, I kept going. And I did really bad on the tests. Some research shows that students like Maldonado and the others at the STEM Academy complete more classes and are less likely to drop out for at least a year after their summer introduction to college. Whether those gains continue past that first year isn't as clear. But Justino Guerrero says the studying strategies and time management skills the students are learning in these three days changed his college experience. He went from struggling and feeling overwhelmed to being a student mentor at this year's academy. Now that I know everything about the MESA program and the culture, the learning and everything, it's been easier for me to approach professors and talk about like anything I don't understand. And I actually um, apply every single concept from MESA when I study, when I do homework, when, I, when I'm taking tests. And it actually like made me succeed in my classes. That success is something Alvarez doesn't want students to take for granted. But careful that you think you discovered some shortcuts. <laughs> you can do this much easier. You know, Justino takes an hour to do this. I figured that I can do it in 15 minutes. And I can still make it to the party on time and, and do all that good stuff, right? Um, wrong. Looking for shortcuts has consequences. He tells them half of students fail intermediate algebra and 60% fail trigonometry. You need to learn to do it and do it the right way and, and practice it, practice it, practice it. Almost like, remember, I said this is a fight. Shaky academic footing is just one of the challenges the students Alvarez works with face. He says financial concerns and family responsibilities can also derail a community college career. What we're trying to do is to empower them and help them be successful in the academic area, hopefully to overcome those other challenges that they have in their personal lives as well. Before the second day of the academy is over, the students are talking and joking like old friends. And Marissa Maldonado says her feelings about starting college have already changed. I was completely nervous. Actually, I'm saying was, because now it makes a big difference. I'm prepared, and I feel like going into my, my first class, I'll be a role model for those around me. Alvarez wants to grow the summer academy to plant more models for student success on City College's campus. How about a round of applause for Kelvert, KPBS News.